So, rationalize the denominator and simplify each of the following. So, what does it mean by rationalize? So, no cert at denominator. So, how to remove cert? So, basically, you see before, if we have the cert n square, we can remove the cert. So, to remove the set, we must have square inside. So, what should you do? So, for A, 2 over set 5. To remove the set, we must get 5 square. So, that we can remove the set. So, we will multiply with the same number. With the same set. Time, set 5 over set 5. So, set and set, which is equal to 2, set 5. Set times set is equal to set. And what is inside 5 times 5? So, it's equal to 2 third 5 is equal to third 5 square. So, this one can be cut off. So, we get 2 third 5 over 5. Okay. See? And same with B. So, B 7 over third 2. So, to remove the third, we will multiply with third 2 as well. So, that when we have uh, 2 square, with set, we can cut off square and set. So, we see 7 over set 2 times set 2 over set 2. So, we get 7 set 2 over set. So, set times set means set, big set. And what's inside multiply. So, 2 times 2 is 2 square. Now, square and set can be cut off. So, we get 7 set 2 over 2. For C, we have set 2 and set 5. So, to remove the set, same. So, set 2 over set 5 times set 5 over set 5. So, we get set 2 times set 5. So, multiply set means set plus set 2 times 5 over set 5. Set 5 times set 5 means set plus set. 5 times 5 is 5 square. So, we get set 10 over 5. Okay. For D, we have set 3 over 2, set 12. So, we want to remove the set. We multiply with the same set. So, that we can get square and then cut square with set. So, set 3 over 2, set 12. Time set 12 over set 12. So, it's equal to set and set is equal to 36 divided by. So, this one 2. 2 set 12 times set 12. So, we take the number. This is 1 and 2 times 1 is 2. Set 12 times set 12 means set 12 square. So, 12 and set can be cut off. So, you see here we have 36. 36 is equal to 6 square over 2 times this one is 12 so 6 square set 6 square is equal to 6 so we have 6 over 12 times 2 times 12 is 24 now can be cut into divided by 6 we get 1 over 4 1 plus set 3 over set 12 so again we multiply with set 12 so that we can get 12 square is equal to 1 plus set 3 over set 12 times set 12 over set 12. Because set 12 over set 12 is equal to 1. So, we multiply first set 12 times 1 is equal to set 12. And then plus set 12 times set 3 is plus set 12 times 3 over set 12 times set 12 is set 12 square. So, set 12 square, we can cut square and set. We get 12. So, we have set 12 plus 36 over 12. So, you see here, so we see here, 12 is equal to 4 times 3 is equal to 2 square times 3 and 36 is equal to 6 square. So, we have set 2 square times 3 plus set 6 square over 12. So, we see here, set 2 square times 3 times set 3 is 1 square and set can be cut off plus 6 over 12. So, this one can also be cut. So, we have 2 set 3 over 12 
plus 6 over 12. So this one can be cut, which we get 1 over 6. This one you get 1 over 2. So it's equal to 1, set 3 over 6 plus 1 over 2. For F, 3 plus set 2 over 5 minus set 5. So we see here, we cannot just multiply with set 5 because we have uh, expression here. So what we should do, we still remember A minus B times A plus B is equal to A square minus B square. So, same for the third. For example, if you have third A minus B and third A plus B, so we will have third A square minus B square. So, we can cut the third and we get A minus B square. So, the same with B. So, whenever we have, we have expression like this, so 5 minus third or third minus 5, we need to multiply with the conjugate. So we see here, if A minus B, we multiply with A plus B. If A plus B, we multiply with A minus B. So we see here, we have 5 minus 5. So we need to multiply with 5 plus 5. See here. So, times 5 plus 5, 5 plus 5. So, 3 times 5 is 15 and then plus 3 times set 5 is 3 set 5. So, set 2 times 5 is equal to plus 5 set 2 and then set 2 times set 5 is equal to plus set times set is equal to 2 times 5. So, over. So, we see here if A minus B times a plus b so we square a and we square b and don't forget the minus 1 so 5 square is 25 and minus set 5 square means set 5 times set 5 or equal to slash set 5 times 5 or 5 square so now we can cut off the set so we see here so we have So we have set 5, set 2 and set 10 which cannot be combined. So but we have 25 minus 5 which is 20. So 15 plus 3 set 5 plus 5 set 2 plus set 10 over 25 minus 5 is 20. So G 6 minus set 3 over 9 minus set 12. So we multiply with, this one is 9 minus set 12. So we multiply with minus with plus. So times 9 plus set 12 over 9 plus set 12. So 6 times 9 is equal to 54. 6 times set 12 is equal to plus 6 set 12. And then negative set 3 times 9 is equal to minus 9 set 3. And then negative set 3 times 12 is equal to minus set 3 times 12 is 36. Set 3 times 3 times 12 is 36. So set 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 36 over 9 square minus set 12 square. So set 12 square can be cut off. So we have okay. So before that we see here we have 12. So 12 is equal to 2 square. So we see here, 12 is equal to 2 square times 3 or 4 times 3. So 2 can be taken, taken out. And then we have 36 which is equal to 6 square. So 9 square minus 12 is equal to 69. Okay. Now we have 6 square here. So which can be cut, we get 6. And then we have here, okay, 54 plus so we have this one is 2 square times 3 which is 6. So 2 square times 3. So this one can be cut off. Minus 9 so 3. This one is minus 6. So we get here 6 times 2 is 12. 12 times 3 which is equal to 54. 
plus 6 times 2 is 12, 12 sec 3 minus 9 sec 3 minus 6 over 69. So 54 minus 6 is 48 and 12 minus 9 is negative 3 sec 3 over 69. So if we divide it by 3, we get 16 plus 3 divided by 3 is 1 sec 3. 69 divided by 3 is 23. Is 15. 3 times set 2 is plus 3 set 2. And then set 2 times 5 is plus 5 set 2. And set 2 times set 2 is plus set 2 square over 5 square is 25 minus set 2 square is 2. So we have so 15. Plus, okay, this one is 2. 15 plus 2, 3, times, uh, 3 plus 5 is plus 8, so 2. Over 25 minus 2 is 23, which is equal to 17 plus 8, so 2 over 23. Alright, for the second one, 4 minus 3 over 7 plus 3 times 7 minus 3 over 7 minus 3. So this one is plus, so multiply by negative. So we have 4 times 7 is 28. 4 times negative 3 is minus 4 3. And then negative 3 times 7 is minus 7 3. Negative 3 times negative 3 is positive 3 square. Okay. Over 7 square is 49 minus 3 square is 3. So 49 minus 3 is 46. It's equal to 46. This one is 28 plus 3 is 31. Negative 4. Negative 4 set 3 minus 7 set 3. It's negative 4 minus 7 is minus 11 set 3. So we have so we have here the first one is the first one is 17 plus 8 set 2 over 23. So we have second one is minus this one is 31 minus 11 set 3 over 46. Alright, so this one is multiply 2 over 2 to get 46. So, 2 over 2 times 17 plus 8, set 2 over 23 plus 31 minus 11, set 3 over 46. So, 2 times 17 is 34 plus 2 times 8 is 16, set 2. And then plus 31 minus 11, set 3. So, over 46. So, 34 plus 31 is equal to 65 plus 16 set 2 minus 11 set 3 over 46. So, for I, we have 7 minus set 5 over 5 plus set 5 minus 6 plus set 3 over 6 minus set 3. So we rationalize both. We do this first. 7 minus 5 over 5 plus 5 times 5 minus 5 over 5 minus 5 which is equal. So 7 times 5 is 35. 7 times negative 5 is minus 7 5. Negative 5 times 5 is minus 5 5. Negative set 5 times negative set 5 is positive set 5 square over 5. This one is plus and negative. So means 5 square minus set 5 square. So you see square and set can be cut off. So we have 35 plus 5 is 40. So this one is minus 7 minus 5 is minus 12 set 5 over 25 minus 5 is 20. So the first expression we have 40 minus 12 set 5 over 20. And then we have minus here. Now we find the second one. Uh, yeah. 
lepas sikit. So the second one. So 6 okay we can 6 plus third 3 over 6 minus third 3 time 6 plus third 3 over 6 plus third 3 you see minus so we time we plus so 6 times 6 is 36 6 times third 3 is plus 6 third 3 negative uh third 3 times 6 is third 3 times 6 is plus 6 third 3 set 3 times set 3 is set 3 square over this one is 6 square 36 minus set 3 square is set 3 so we have set 3 square can be cut off so 36 plus 3 is equal to 39 39 so plus 6 6 set 3 and 6 set 3 is plus 12 set 3 over so 36 minus 3 is 33. So we have minus minus 39 plus 12 set 3 over 33. Okay. So we have here 40 minus 12 set 5 over 20 minus 39 plus 12 set 3 over 33. So, so, if we directly do this, we can see the number will be very large because 20 times 33. But you see here, for the first expression, everything can be divided by 4. So, if we divide by 4, 40 divided by 4, 10. 12 divided by 4, 3 is 5. And 20 divided by 4 is equal to 5. And then this one, everything can be divided by 3. If we divide by 3, we get... 39 divided by 3 is 13 plus 12 divided by 3 is 4 set 3 and 33 divided by 3 is 11. So now this one can multiply by 5. Multiply by 11 over 11 and this one multiply by 5 over 5. To make the denominator equal so everything will be over 55. So 11 times 10 is 110. 11 times negative 3 set 5 is minus 33 set 5 is minus 65 13 times 13 times 5 is 65 so minus 65 so you see here and then 5 times 4 set 3 is plus 20 set 3 So we have 110 minus 65 is equal to 110 minus 65 is equal to so we group together 110 minus 65 is 45 and then set 3 and set 5 cannot be combined so minus 33 set 5 plus 20 set 3 over 55.